Hey, what's going on everybody? Jason here. It is project time. Uh, I have not done an aquarium project in quite a while and we are gonna make a wooden canopy for my 33 gallon for Floki. Um, honestly, I think canopies are kind of a pain in the butt, especially if you wanna do water changes. I think you gotta take the whole canopy off. Um, but, uh, why not? You know, I think it'll look cool. And especially when I'm sitting on the couch and I have the tank like right next to me, the, I can see the light of the aquarium because I have it raised and it glares in my face all the time. It's kind of annoying. So uh, with the canopy, uh, the light will be hidden in there and I think it'll be kind of cool. Plus I never made one before. Why not? Let's try it. I also ordered two lights. I'm gonna have one on each side of the canopy because I'm gonna have a divider in the middle um, those lights should be here tomorrow. I got off, got them off of Amazon. They're night crew lights, something like that, LEDs. But those will be here tomorrow and I'll show you that. And, but for right now, let me show you the wood that I got. Okay, here is the wood. I got those and I've got that big old piece, which that's only four by two. Uh, these are all about six feet long. So these two, this one and this one right here, those are, uh, I want to say three quarter by six feet by four inches. It's like a one by four, basically, I think. Uh, these right here are going to make the frame that actually sit on top of the tank. And this is what's going to wrap around them and actually be the lip. That's the, this is what you're actually going to see. I got some thin stuff. It's only quarter inch thick because it's just on the outside. I don't need it too thick. And I want this to be very slim. I don't want a really boxy huge canopy uh and then this big piece this is a, like a one by 12 and then that that's going to make the top of the canopy i'm just going to have one small little lid uh on hinges to open up and i got me some hinges uh got me some spray paint and i got me some of these metal uh, uh they're these are i don't know what the heck you even call them just these metal like kind of bracket strips uh, they're very, very bendable, so I'm going to make my own brackets to hold the lights in underneath the top of the lid. It's going to be kind of hard to explain to you guys exactly how this is going to look. I will just show you as I go along. Okay, the top part is done, as you guys just saw on the tank. Um, I'm sorry I didn't get to show too much assembly on it, but my phone was at 15% and I had to charge it up for a little bit, so. But, as you can see, this is just screwed in. I still need to go over it and sand it. Some of this is a little bit rough right there, but it's all gonna get painted anyway. Uh, I used this clamp to clamp the sides and make sure everything was nice and flush. I did this on my dining room table inside because it's perfectly flat. There is no flat surfaces out here. And a lot of this wood from Home Depot is not perfectly flat either. So I needed a nice flat surface to clamp all this down. Make sure you pre-drill your holes. You don't want to split your wood, but uh, this is not attached to anything as you can see. But uh, so this is upside down right now. I cut the holes for the 
filters to fit. All I did was measure how much space I needed. I drilled holes here and here, and then used my jigsaw to cut out the slots for the filters. This is not perfectly flush, as you can see here and here, but that won't matter. It doesn't need to sit on that brace on the tank. All of this is gonna rest on the, the tank trim. So I'm gonna go ahead and actually start cutting the top and the lid, and once that's attached, then we will make the, the sides that overhang that go over the trim of the tank.
Okay, the canopy is pretty much done. It came out really, really good. Um, really liking this. Nice small profile. I did not want a huge high canopy. Just something uh, that'll kind of match the stand, won't be too much. But All right, so this will be part one, guys. Uh, part two, we'll finish it. I gotta paint it. I've gotta install the hinges. Those were not installed when uh, you saw them on the tank. They were just laying there for aesthetic purposes. And if you notice, the canopy would not go all the way on the tank in the back because of the other light holder I have on there. Uh, I have to take that off. Um, I have to unscrew that. I gotta do a water change. Um, when it's light enough, I can move the tank and the stand out of the way and then take that light holder off and then that'll fit on. Uh, I was still waiting for the lights from Amazon tomorrow, so we'll install, I gotta paint it first, install the lights, and then uh, put the hinges on the lid and it'll be done. And uh, really like the way it came out. So stay tuned for part two.